Every video I've ever filmed at Red Lipstick, at some point in the video it's gotten on my teeth so we're just doing a check and we're all G. Yup. Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. So guys, I'm so so pumped for this video, like I'm so excited, I can't even explain the excitement, it's insane. <laughs> So for today's video, I'm going to be testing items from Wish and I've never ever bought from Wish before so this is going to be my very first time, my very first genuine first impressions and yeah, what I actually think of the website. Every single item I bought was under $3 or pounds or euro, whatever you want to say. So everything I bought was under $3 whatever and that is just so cheap. So I wanted to see what can I actually buy for $3, like for that amount of money, can I actually get anything worth my while and that is what we're going to be finding out today so I bought a mixture of clothes and items so items that you can use so like different kind of things I don't want to spoil it for you guys I actually can't remember everything I got because I placed this order about two months ago and everything only arrived about two weeks ago so it takes a bloody long time so before I jump in I just want to say please give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this one in the future because if you guys are interested in that I would love to film them and also please subscribe down below if you haven't already because I appreciate it so so much and join our amazing family so yes with that said let's just jump right in and get on to the video so I actually had all my packages in a plastic bag but they're all here and some are still in the bag so we've got a lot of things to get through I went a bit crazy a little bit crazy right I'm just gonna go this feels really hard okay <gasps> yes Okay, right. Okay, we've got a selfie light. We've got a selfie light. I don't have the exact pricing for everything, but every single thing I bought was under three pound. Like I was being so serious with myself on it. So we've got a selfie light, okay? And I actually have one of these, like that was like 25 euro or something, which is a rip off, like for a silly light that you stick on your phone. So the first thing I will say is the box is damaged. Can you guys see that? I don't know if it was put in like that or if it just happened in the post, but we're gonna open it. Oh, there's like a hair. There's a hair on my light. Right, so it did have plastic over it. It seems to work. So if you're not um, familiar with selfie lights, they just like clip on the top of your phone like that. And then like a light comes up and you can use it for like a selfie. Right, we need some batteries. Right, we're doing the old take them out with the remote control job because I do not have any batteries handy. So the one thing with Wish is that the delivery is actually a lot more expensive than the items are a lot of the time. Like for a majority of these items, I paid more on the delivery than I did for the item itself, which is so silly, but like whatever. So I've got the batteries in. Oh, I'm really impressed with this. Right, so it's got three different settings. This is the first one. This is the second one. And this is the third one. It's actually just like my original one. Like it's literally the same. Right, let me take a selfie, let me try. Okay, and it actually looks nice in a selfie. Like I just took a selfie and it actually like really looks pretty. I'm really impressed with this. This was so worth it. Like this worked out at like 250 or something, like euro. Like what a bargain. Right, so we've got our next package here, right? Let's just do it. Okay, it's a clothing item. Right, guys. Okay, so do you know them like little alien shirts? You know, like with the little alien? I got one of them. So it's basically just white and it's like got an alien on it. But the material. Okay, the material is really strange. It actually looks like a... Okay, the inside is actually really soft, I will say. But... It just kind of looks like, I don't know. Right, we're gonna try it on and see what it looks like on because, you know, things can be very like distorted when you're looking at them, like, you know, just like this. It's got a bit of a musty smell off it. Okay, have it on and for three pound, I'm not mad. I'm actually not mad. Right, so the sleeves are a little bit tight. Like it's not that comfortable. Like, you know, like it's a bit restricted. But the material is actually really comfortable. It's not a really itchy material and it just looks like this. So it's like, it's not even really cropped. It's like, it actually comes to your waist. So it's quite a nice size. Um, I actually quite like it. I probably will wear it again in a video or something. But like, I actually think it's cute. Like as pajamas or loungewear, it's quite cozy. Right, we're going for this thing, whatever it is. Okay, right. <laughs> Okay, I don't even know why I bought this. 
So it's all in Chinese. The directions and everything is in Chinese. Really? Like, how come on all of our products, you know like any products you buy in Ireland or England or wherever you live, there's always like English directions, Chinese directions, like German directions, like there's always different languages of what to do. But this is just a bit rude. Huh? How am I, I don't know, I, I, do, I don't even know what it's for. Okay, so on my laptop, I just went through like my order and it says that this is a blackhead remover. So that is very interesting. So I'm gonna try and work this contraption after I film the video and I'm gonna stick in an overlay of me pathetically trying to use this device because I don't know what the instructions say so I'm just gonna to have to try and wing it. But yeah, it looks interesting. If this worked though, that would be really cool. It's meant to like remove your blackheads. If this works, your girl gonna be blackhead free. <laughs> Okay guys, so it's the next day um, and I'm trying to work the contraption that is the blackhead remover. Um, so basically, I don't know what batteries it needs because the instructions are in Chinese. So the only battery that will fit is a triple A. So like, you know, like the really small ones, but it doesn't even go in very well. Like it doesn't have the little springs to hold the battery. So I'm thinking, are batteries different over the other side of the world? Like, I don't know. And also I noticed that when you have like the batteries in and stuff, there's like no on or off button. So there is no button to make it work. And like the battery's just floating around in there, so it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Are you shocked? No. Am I shocked? Definitely not. But like, that sucks. Like, no. <laughs> no. Okay, next thing. This is so fun. <gasps> right, we got a top, we got another clothing. Voila! Right, I've been wanting this top for so long or like a top similar. I've seen so many people with them. It's from like, it's the like writing of American Horror Story and it's a quote from American Horror Story and it just says normal people scare me because they do. So yeah, I'm really excited to like put this on. Like I've really wanted like this t-shirt for quite a while and then it was like literally like what, $2 or something. So I was like, huh, I'm gonna try it. So let's try this bad boy on. Okay, I really like it. It's not itchy, it's very comfortable. Um, I would have gotten a size larger though like I have heard that about wish though that their sizing is quite off because they're like a Chinese company like they have different sizing so if you are ordering from wish I would say always order up a size actually I got this in a medium this is a medium are you joking me are you actually joking me this just like about fits me like even my arm it's really tight in my arm that is ridiculous i would have said like this is an extra small but it's a medium um so yeah i would have probably got the large because it's very tight around my boobies and stuff like that so but i really like the top for three pound like i'm not i'm not angry i i i'll take it i'll take it right let's go with this oh I keep opening all the clothing items, I'm so sorry. I've got like loads of other stuff that aren't clothes as well. No way. I love it, right? So it is a red little crop top and it says no time for fuck boys. Fuck boys with a Z. Oh yeah, you know she ain't messing about. <laughs> fuck boys. It looks very, very, very small though. Like, can you see that? Like it literally looks like it could be like a little bralette. But we're gonna try it. I really like the colouring and stuff though. And the material is quite thin, but like it's not, I don't think it's gonna be see-through. Okay, so this is like not very comfortable at all. It is way too tiny. Um, I left my bra on as well just for the purpose of this video because like I literally feel like my boobs will be out. It is very, very, very small. And this is choking me. Oh, that's so much better. Yeah, I really like it, but it's just a bit small. Again, the sizing thing. I think I even got this in a medium, but like this is teeny tiny. But yeah, it's just the sizing. Like I like the design and the top of it, but it's just the size is way too small. I would never wear this out. I'd probably wear it for a photo or something and then that would be it. I feel like it might be cuter if it was just like little straps and like it didn't tie around here because the string is really uncomfortable when you tie it around your neck. I don't even understand. I just put my little jumper on over because I feel very exposed. So we're going on to the next one. Okay. Oh, okay, we've got a hat. We've got a hat. Oh my goodness. Right, this actually feels like cardboard. It is actually cardboard. And that is not going to fit over my head. My head is like not gonna fit in that that is tiny that is actually tiny okay that this is like a big no the material is just like really really bad it's like cardboard 
Right, we can try it, but yeah, it does not go over my head. <laughs> hey, ho, hey, what am I doing? This is no, 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 no. Moving on. We've got a really teeny tiny one. What could this be? What could it be, I wonder? I swear to God, the postman must have thought I had lost the plot because I was getting these Chinese packages to my house for a solid month. And like the shop I work in, like my postman always comes in. And like, I remember one day he even came into work and he was like, oh, I've got a package for you. And it was like some of these, like he was probably like, what is this girl ordering? Like some weird freaky shit. <laughs> I don't even know where I bought this, like really Jessica. Jessica, you really outdone yourself this time. So I bought a razor holder. <laughs> I'd never seen one before and I got excited and I was like, oh, that might be really handy because I always just like leave my razor like on the side of the bath or something. And I feel like that's not very hygienic, like, I don't know. So I think I saw this and just got excited, but like, what was I thinking? Okay, I'm gonna like insert a clip of me trying to um, put this on the wall and seeing if it holds my razor or not. But yeah, it's a, <laughs> a nice razor holder. <laughs> I give up. I give up. We got another little package, a teeny tiny package. Okay. So I ordered some eyelashes and these look cute. Cute. Look at this. I'm actually really impressed. These actually look really pretty. Do you know what these literally look identical to? Is the Demi Wispy Lashes from Ardell. Like, they look so wispy. They don't look very dramatic around, unlike these bad boys that I'm wearing right now. But I'm really happy in, with these. Okay, we've got another teeny tiny package. Oh, it looks like a top and it looks minute. It looks minute, mascara. I can, I can hardly see it. It's that like, how is this meant to cover my tits? The booby pads. Once I feel booby pads, I'm like, no. Okay, so this is a little crop top that has got booby pads in it. I'm not a fan of the booby pads. Is that just me? Like, I know a lot of girls really like them because it gives you some support and you don't have to wear a bra. Yeah, I don't know what it is in like tops like these, like crop tops. I feel like the booby pads are really obvious, especially in this because the material is actually quite see-through. So maybe that's why they put them in, but I feel like, I don't know. Right, I'm gonna try it on nevertheless. But um, it just looks like this basically. So it just looks like this. It's actually really cute and I'm actually not mad with the booby pads anymore. <laughs> so yeah, it is actually really cute. I feel like the little pads, they do actually give you a bit of support because you could definitely not wear a bra with this top. And as I was saying, like the original material is very see-through. So it just gives you a little bit of cover. Um, I really like this. I will actually definitely wear this again. It's quite um small, like it's a very short crop top if that's not what you're into. I'm all about the crop top still, like in high-waisted jeans and all. So I will definitely wear this again. I'm, I'm really happy with this. We've still got loads. Oh, it's another clothing item, right? And this one actually says size M. So that's just me showing you, like I actually genuinely bought all these clothes in an M. And like they're all like an extra small it's actually ridiculous like that is like awful like you know what i mean like that that's bang out of order i think in my opinion that they don't have a versatile sizing range like oh they're little shorts they're like little runner shorts oh they look really cute right okay i'm gonna try these on these are gonna be fine like aren't they i'll probably just these are a size m a medium and look how tiny they are like damn, like damn. So they just look like this on me. I was hovering over my kitchen chair trying to show you guys them. So if it looks a bit strange, that is why. I love the color of them. They're really comfortable, really soft material. And literally they were like two pound. So I'm actually really happy with these. Me and my sister are going to Orlando for playlist again this year in April. So I'll probably bring these for just like pool shorts, you know, like when you're chilling by the pool, like little runner shorts like these are so perfect. And yeah, they're so cute. The jumper's going back on. I feel so naked. Okay, right, we've got another one. I'm so, I'm actually really enjoying this. Oh no, it's another top and it looks so teeny tiny. So far, I'm actually really impressed. Oh, okay, right. Oh, the material of this is really nice. 
it's like a silk it's obviously not silk but it's like a silk it's that really okay it's actually like okay damn that is see true but it's a really like sheer silky material maybe the sheer is not going to be so good so I've actually wanted to pick up this top for so long and I just haven't. So it's like, it says, you are my sunshine, my moon and all my stars. That's what you guys are. Oh my God, that's what you guys are. You're my sunshine, my moon and all my stars. I really love this kind of style and then it like goes behind the neck. But I just hope it's not really see-through because this top is going to be hard to wear a brow with. Because it's one of them tops that like scoops down really low. So if you wear a brow it's just going to look a bit ridiculous. But we'll try it on. I don't know what it is about black that always washes me out on camera. It's crazy. I actually love this. I actually love it. The only problem is of the material and like you kind of have to not wear a brow with this kind of a top. But like we'd work around it, you know, stick a bit of sticky tape on your nipples and you're good to go. But no, I really actually like it. It's really comfortable because the material's like so like silky or something. It's really cozy. And I'm really impressed. I actually really like this. I would definitely wear this again. Okay. Oh. Oh. What noises am I making today? I'm like someone off like a cartoon. I can't open this one. <laughs> What the hell is this? I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. <gasps> okay, right, cool. Okay, so this is the nail. Um, so it's basically meant to dry your nails. It's meant to be like an LED light. So basically, I'm gonna have to plug this in, like put some nail varnish on my nail and then stick it under. And it's meant to dry your nails. I don't know how quick though, but these things normally work really quickly. So I'm gonna put um, nail varnish on a nail stick it under for 20 seconds and I'm gonna see if after the 20 seconds it is dried or not yeah I don't I don't think this is gonna work I really don't like I don't see this working but I was very intrigued by it because I am the worst person when it comes to nail varnish I cannot wait I cannot wait I literally just go do something even pick up my phone and I always ruin my nails do you know if like you knock your nail off something when it's got nail varnish on it and it's still drying and it like gets all the bumps in it I do that every time that's why I don't normally wear nail varnish because I normally ruin and have to take it off so this would be really really convenient if it works so I'm gonna stick in a clip of me testing out this bad boy as well so I just plugged the USB side into my laptop and I'm going to stick this bit in here Oh wait, and then the on button is on the front. Oh my god, it's blue. Okay, right, so now I'm going to paint like two of my nails. Okay, so I just have one coat on both of my nails and I'm going to stick it under. Okay, I think the blue light turns off when it's done. Okay, so this is interesting. So I'm going to wait for the blue light to turn off. Oh, it's gone off. Okay, right, so this is the tester. Do, are they dry? Oh, <gasps> they're actually dry. Look at this. Oh no. Never mind, some of the nail varnish just came off. Look at that. That does not work. Okay, let's go. What you say? You already know. <laughs> Jeez, I just choked on my own spit there. I got really excited. <laughs> so this is a pack of eight chokers, if I'm remembering right. Oh, right, I'm really excited about this. So we got one, we got two, three, we got four. We got five, we got six, we got seven, and we've got eight chokers. Would you ever get eight chokers anywhere else for three dollars? No. You would literally pay a tenner for this yin yang choker in somewhere like Topshop and River Island, even more. So this is the one we're gonna try out, okay. I'm not gonna try them all on because like we'll be here all day, but I'm just gonna try one on because like if one fits, they all should fit, right? Oh, I'm really bad with um buckling chokers of myself the struggle is real come on baby <laughs> yeah i probably could have done with putting on a tighter one but this is just the look so i could definitely like i could put it like this tight but i'm actually really impressed i think this is so adorable that is actually really cute i'm so bad like i've literally been trying to do this for five minutes but yeah i'm actually really impressed I really like that. Yeah, this is way too loose, but you know, you get the drift. If you're anything like me, chokers are not something you want to be spending a lot of money on because if you're anything like me, you take jewelry off and leave it anywhere and always forget where it is and it always gets lost. So yeah, I'm not, I'm actually really impressed. These are so perfect for me. There's like a little, um, kind of like a crochet detailing one. 
There's like, just like a plain string one. There is one with little flowers on it, which is adorable. They're all black, by the way. There is a basic velvet one. I'm really, I'm really happy with these. Deadly, deadly, deadly stuff. Next one. Oh, that is actually disgusting. There's actually like long hairs stuck to the label. Let's get, they're probably your hairs for crying out loud. Oh, if they're not though, this is actually disgusting. Is this actually a joke? I'm gonna insert a picture right here what I thought I was buying, like the photo of what I was buying. So it was basically meant to be like a little charging port for your phone and in the photo was like a little circle um, device-y thing and basically you're meant to stick your phone on it. But this looks like an actual sample and it's just got the iPhone thing sticking out of it. What is this shit? Oh my goodness, that is ridiculous. It actually just looks like this. And then there's like a, a little phone connector. What the hell? <laughs> How is this meant to work? Right. Oh, this looks... I don't even want to put this in my phone. It'll probably break it. Okay, I'm just after getting it in. And it's not charging. Shocker. I, like, that was never going to work. That was never going to work. How is... So it says wireless charging receiver for iPhone 7, 6, 6S, 5, 5S. Yeah, you're full of shit. Well, we, we've done really well, so I knew we were gonna have something, something disastrous, but I was really like, I thought that was gonna work, but <laughs> anywho. Jesus, some of these packages are like literally done. You'd swear there was like money in it or something. Oh my God, I can't open it. Ah, oh, I got one of these things for my phone. So it's basically the same idea as a pop socket. See, I didn't have this pop socket on my phone before I ordered this, so like I really don't need this now. But it's the exact same idea, so like you can use it as a stand, as you can see like there's a little ring on it. So use it as a stand, or you can just hold it, and it's rose gold. It's actually really pretty, it has like little diamantes the whole way around, and it says love, but there is a lot of scratches on it, so like, I'm guessing this has been used. Yeah, oh my god, it's actually full of scratches. So yeah, I'm not actually going to put this on my phone because I have one already and if I take this off, there's going to be a big mark on my otter box. But no, I'm, that's cute, like, I would have definitely used this if I didn't have a pop socket, but yeah. So that was everything that I ordered on Wish and I'm actually really impressed, like we had more successes than fails. So I'm not angry, I'm not mad and you know, it could have went a lot worse. Like if any of you guys saw my eBay videos, like... Jesus, they were bad. Like, that was really bad. But, like, some of these things I'll actually get use out of again. So, you know, yay. If any of you guys have any requests of any of these kind of videos you want me to do in the future, definitely let me know in the comments down below because I'm going to be taking them all into consideration. I want to start doing a lot more videos like this because I enjoy them so much and I love watching them. I love you guys with all in my heart. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.